Hello guys, this video will be how I've made the Renault F1 team logo on the wall of my playroom. So let's watch it. So the first thing to do before starting anything was to measure and find the center of the wall. Uh, after that, just holding the center was very easy with my laser. I just had to put the, the middle line or the line of the laser uh, right on my mark. And from that, it was only a matter of moving the laser from up to down to find the bottom, the top and the center of the logo or the size of piece that I want to and to measure how wide the piece was supposed to be it was also easy after I had the measurement of the vertical line uh, of the laser I just split my measurement in two in that case was 100 centimeter uh, split in two so I put 50 centimeter on each side of the line at this point I need to apologize because I had to replace the battery in my camera and I haven't seen it uh, when it stopped so uh, I missed the part when I taped the middle section of the part so I'm sorry about that. I decided to make the first coat of paint uh, with a brush instead of the roller so uh, this way I control how much paint I put on the tape. Uh, since the tape was not sticking very well on the wall uh, and I didn't want any paint to go underneath the tape so I decided to kind of stick the tape with brush so it will be kind of stuck in the paint when I will go over the tape with the roller. The reason why I, I'm not using frog tape or a green tape or blue tape for that matter uh, is because it was not sticking uh, hard enough on the wall. Uh, I did make the shape with frog tape the night before and at the morning it was all on the ground. Even that crazy white masking tape is not sticking very well on the wall. I don't know why but that paint seems to have like a dusty finish and doesn't allow the tape to stick very well. Hello guys, we're back for the second coat. So from now I will go with the roller. Uh, but now let's start it. <laughs> I really feel like I'm playing with mustard here. And if you wonder what uh, shirt that I'm wearing, what t-shirt that I'm wearing, it is the Racing League Online that I'm racing in. Uh, it's called Invectus Racing League. They have uh, six, five leagues. Uh, yeah, five leagues, one Oasis League, one league uh, with realistic performance uh, of 2018 car. It's the, the, all leagues are on the 2018 F1 game from Co-Master. The three other leagues are uh, uh, equal performance league F1, F2, and F3, uh, and you can be placed in one of these leagues depending on your pace and your experience, stuff like that. But it worked having a look, guys. If you do a search on Invictus Racing League on Google, you will fall right on it. But I will put the link in the description here so you can see by yourself and it will be easier to find. <laughs> seen my table whatever stuff like that I will zoom in a bit so you have a more uh, a better look of the paint of what it's look like at the moment I will try not to hide everything while I'm painting but I need to be in front of the camera a bit 
so it's kind of hard to see for you. Here it looks like I'm painting over a fresh coat of paint, but don't worry, I've waited one hour and a half between every coat. I just cut the drying time in the hesitant. Hey guys, we're there for the fifth or sixth coat, I don't remember. I don't even think a uh, six coat will be enough because it was yellow on black. <laughs> Maybe I should use a primer before, but I have all that paint, so. Finally, this will be the final coat, the uh, seventh and final coat. Maybe if I use, uh, obviously, if I I'd use some primer. I will probably put only three coat, but anyway, what's done is done. The result will be the same, will be great. To make sure I don't rip off the paint when I will remove the tape, I decide to cut the paint just beside the tape before starting pulling on it. Uh, I, I did a test and as soon as I start pulling on it, the paint uh, looked like it was to come with the tape, so I didn't take any chances and I, I cut the, the, the paint. Uh, especially with the two little arm or the two fin uh, on the top right and on the bottom left, if I haven't cut the paint, at this area it's for sure that the paint would have come with the tape since it's very thin slice of tape While I was removing the masking tape, uh, I tear up some part of the black behind the logo or under the tape. So now I'm getting ready to apply some black paint, the same uh, matte black that I've used for the wall uh, to fix the, the imperfection. There are very little, as you can see, there's a little uh, white spot, which is the drywall uh, in the bottom 
horn or the bottom fin i don't know how you call it uh, and a couple of spots around the logo but it's pretty much done by now So this is it guys and there is a 360 degree view of my game room at the moment. I still have some cable management to do around my shelf where you can see there's some uh, wires linked down to speakers to PC and stuff like that. But the really big thing that left to do in my room is, is my F1 cockpit, my uh, sim racing police seat and the reason that it's still on Bearwood is because I'm waiting to February 19th. Uh, for Renault to reveal their new livery and their new aero so I can finish my uh, my rig as soon as I will see the livery and the shape of the new car I will start sculpting my lines and uh, get my police seat ready for the start of the season in Australia this is it for today guys please like the video and subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit the little bell so you will get the notification as soon as i will release a new video so on this i wish you a great day and see you later goodbye